Innovation is something new, something that changes the world. Typically when, when you're thinking about innovation, you're thinking about a better way of solving a problem. Edison said, the genius is 99% perspiration and 1% inspiration. Well, when it comes to innovation, there's one part missing from that quote, perseverance. Um, I think one of the perfect examples of innovation here at Goddard uh, is the work that was done by Wanda Peters, uh, the Lotus-based coatings. Um, that type of technology where this particular coating doesn't allow particles or dust to affect the surface at all. If we think about it, and we're talking about missions to Mars or lunar missions, uh, it's providing that extra layer of protection for our satellites and our instruments and our rovers as well. At the same time, we can use that technology here on Earth. If you have some sort of device in the desert where it's susceptible to dust storms or things like that, um, this particular coating is going to protect that, that uh, instrument. NASA is a powerhouse of innovators. It provides the tools the innovators need to make the innovations actually happen. They're giving you the opportunity to really utilize new technology, new science, and also allowing you to describe your ideas for new science and technology. NASA will continue to uh, fuel that spirit of innovation for everyone else in the world.